Hi, I'm Gargi and my last video was about how to use a hand sanitizer very effectively. In this video, I'll discuss about what could be the negative impacts of using a hand sanitizer excessively. First, if I am exposing my hand to topical applications of hand sanitizers containing ethyl alcohol, I'm stripping the hand of its essential oils, which means it could become prone to dryness. And also, uh, the skin layer on my hand is pretty thin. So if I'm constantly using alcohol, it could also mean that the permeability of other chemicals into my skin is pretty easy. If I'm going to use any other product which is generally regarded as safe, the chemicals could easily permeate through my skin and enter my system. So that's the negative impact. So if I'm constantly using a hand sanitizer, it would be better if I could probably use uh, coconut oil or any other natural cold pressed oils to restore the balance of my skin or the moisture levels. Second, it could also alter the pH on my hand by constantly exposing myself to a hand sanitizer. Third, the resistance to antibiotics becomes gradually lower if I'm constantly exposing myself to a hand sanitizer over a period of time. There have been studies which show this. The next negative impact of using a hand sanitizer, hand sanitizer is that uh, if I am used to making fermentation products at home like yogurt, even if it's a vegan yogurt or bread or uh, like in the Indian cuisine making idli or dosa, the good microflora which is present on my hand which is constantly exposed to a hand sanitizer would kill all the good microflora present on my hand and this would hinder the ability to actively participate in good fermentation processes at my home. So these are the various negative impacts that a hand sanitizer could have upon constant exposure. So it would be very prudent if whenever necessary use a hand sanitizer otherwise Cleaning the hands with soap and water would be the most effective way. Of course, during the coronavirus outbreak, it would be important for us to use a hand sanitizer. But if I could avoid excessively using it, that would be great in terms of keeping or restoring the pH balance of my hand, making sure that the good microflora, which are so essential in carrying out many of our biochemical functions in my body, are also not destroyed with constant exposure to a hand sanitizer and I would also try to reduce that uh, anti, uh, antibiotic resistance which I could possibly develop over a long period of exposure to a hand sanitizer. So let us stay safe during coronavirus and let's use our hand sanitizers more prudently. Thank you and have a safe week ahead.